Well, the collection got developed relatively quickly in, in three months. So for starting a new project and given the circumstances, that was pretty, pretty difficult. But on the other hand, I just had to get on and do it and not think too much or not um, over-intellectualise or procrastinate. Um, so it was quite spontaneous, the process, in, in some ways. It is my office now, which is very Im important. I think I, I respect who Oscar is and, and was and all that he achieved. Um, I certainly, when I arrived in the house, I didn't want to come in and say, everything has to change, I want new furniture, I want white marble. Uh, I think that's not the important part in the process. You have to start working and have something to, to show first. They want this shorter, so option one, move this up, option two, cut it from here. Every dress comes back from the fitting with a different model or different size than our fit model, so we have to do all the alterations. <laughs> Plus they come up with more ideas, so we have more dresses to make. <laughs> We still have about 20 or more open looks, so there's still a lot of goals to fit. It's going to be a long night. Yeah, it'll be a long night, but I'm used to that. There's maybe just a little bit too much length of zero there. I think I like the idea of starting with black and white to sort of blank, blank canvas in, in some ways and, and building upon that. Very happy, I have to say, because I think um, the, the reaction from, from people that I've heard has been very positive, and I think a lot of people said that they could feel Oscar in the collection, so that is one of the things that I really had wanted to, to achieve. <laughs> same sort of appreciation of women, of beauty, and beyond that of houses, gardens, antiques. Um, 
all of those things I think we've had a lot of common, common ground and um, spoken the same language. <laughs>